Hi, it's Neil Sean here on your entertainment news with the wonderful and marvellous Mr Russell Watson and Mr Simon Weston who tell us all about their latest project. Remember though boys, miss, miss it, it or, or miss out. out. So don't miss Simon and Russell today on your entertainment news. And doing really with the song is commemorating those that were lost it's the centenary it's a hundred years on and there's been some <clears throat> conflab about how we should commemorate and even some people going as far as saying that they don't think it's particularly right to commemorate World War One which I think is complete hogwash actually um, mm. I think that we should re remember are fallen. This is not anybody who gets confused about this being a to generate glamour or or a, any kind of of, of celebration of, of war is is completely wrong. This is a commemoration of of many young souls that were lost at war, and this is our country's way of, of showing their respects, and also young people who may not be aware of of the goings on of the First World War or even the politics behind why the First World War occurred in the first place, but reminding those people of why and the needless loss that, that we, we actually took during that, that very, very ghastly period. Now, this is a commemoration of that. Realistically, Russell was involved in it way before I was. Um, I, I was invited uh, due to some of the people that are involved in it um, from the planning stage, but because I'm uh, president of the Falklands Veterans Foundation, um, they asked me if I would read uh, some poetry uh, just to sort of keep the, the, the war theme going through it. And certainly as we're celebrating the First World War, um, they asked me to read some Wilfred Owen um, poetry, which I was thrilled to do because I do like his poetry but when you read it and then have to read it to record it it's wholly different because um, never having done anything like that before and like Russell who's a consummate performer and knows how to sing and how to bring it all together because he's done a great job but for me it was it was a bit bizarre but it's, it's great been great fun so far we'll see how it all goes now he did a fantastic job when, when, when you listen to when you listen to Simon speak, and when he reads the piece of poetry, um, there's an immediate engagement with 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 his voice, and and that's what you have to have when you know when you're dealing with audio, when you're dealing with music and records, is there has to be an engagement immediately with the voice, and that's what you what what, what we achieve with with, with Simon. be very emotional but it, it won't be you know we'll be going through the various different aspects of different types of music um, we're gonna have the Welsh Guards there backing me up vocally which would be which would be quite something all red robed um, and then I, I think um, we're doing we're doing a concert in Edinburgh where we'll have um, some of the Dragoon Guards there as well I, I find the bike bagpipes so um, inspiring. As soon as I hear a bagpipe, I don't know whether it's something inherent in me or something <laughs> ancestral, but as soon as I hear a bagpipe, I start to well up. Um, so we'll have a big bagpipe dragoon band there as well. Um, and for the first time in my career, um, I'm going to be performing at the, the Palladium, which is going to be absolutely fantastic. So I'm incredibly excited about that. When the lights go down and the ones 
Russell Watson sings the home ground anthem, commemorating those who died in the Great War. Well, this is story. I'm Simon Weston and I know about overcoming adversity, so I'm asking you for your support for other injured people of the armed forces. And also, let's not forget that we're, we're, um, we're raising funds for Hay House, the Coming Home uh, Foundation um, and Home Ground. And those funds will go where Help for Heroes leaves off. Um, this will take over where soldiers are decommissioned from the army. Soldiers with very, very serious injuries, losses of limbs, that type of thing. There's a, a rehousing procedure that takes place once they leave barracks. And this rehousing um, procedure is it's a very, very delicate operation because in, in many cases, there are soldiers with very serious wounds um, that have to have houses specifically tailor-made for their, their needs. So even something as basic as simply having a door arch widened so that they can get their wheelchair into a bathroom can make an absolutely fundamental difference to, to one of these people. Russell Watson sings the home ground anthem, commemorating those who died in the Great War. Well, this is story. I'm Simon Weston and I know about overcoming adversity, so I'm asking you for your support for other injured people of the armed forces. Always be Hi, it's Neil Sean here on your entertainment news with a rather special project. The wonderful and the talented Mr. Russell Watson and of course the divine Mr. Simon Weston tell us all about their latest project. Remember though, boys. Miss it and miss out. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. I was there. Yeah, you see, I you were good. You, you, we beat you did it. You were singing the North Wales and fish and chips. Yeah. I was thinking of be there or be square. <laughs> <laughs> okay.